Hi everyone, just Keith Bestie here. This video, I'm actually going to go through and show you how I one get the actual text uh, for my Magic Pay site, and also how I spin it. This is something what somebody asked for in the group, so this is what I'm going to do. I'm just go through it and just give you a brief overview of how I do it. Now obviously before you do anything like this, you need to understand what your keywords are. So you need to go on keyword research, get all that right first, and then build a site out. Don't just go into you know, building crappy sites, because even if you do get on page one, you are not going to convert, which is then just a waste of time doing it anyway. So sticking with our normal theme, I'm just going to look for locksmith. So we've got locksmith leads. Uh, come down because obviously, I'm, if I was targeting the emergency rockets and leads, then I want to be looking at these guys here. These guys are already on page one, so whatever they're doing, Google likes. Okay, so I really need to be doing the same as them and better. Okay, so I've got these. I'm only going to take a couple, I'm not going to do like you know, I would spend like so, you know, quite a long time going through this picking out what I want and you know formatting a, a way that I find is good. So once you've found them, just go down. Oh I've opened four of Strangely enough there's all they're all good ones. There's no like sort of yell or yelp which you don't want. You also don't want any like the you know Trusted trader and all them sort of things. On. So the first thing I do is have a look. How much content have they got on to be on page one? Now, as you can see, he's got a lot of content, but then again, that's why he was number one. So it's obvious to me that you know we are looking for a lot of content. What's number two got? A lot of content, it's pretty not like, but there you go. Number three, a lot, of, you know, quite a bit of content, not as much as you guys, but quite a bit of content. Um, this one, the first job of your hands is to keep you safe inside. Obviously, somebody's got it. Okay. So again, he's got quite a bit of content on. So, you know, me putting the site up with like sort of, you know, 50 words of content, like sort of, you know, call us now and that's it, is not going to cut it. Google's telling us these guys have got a lot of content on. And, you know, you've got keyword, 25 minutes, locksmith. Qualify locksmiths, locksmiths there, and locksmith there. Non destructive entry from locksmith leads, yeah. Locksmith leads, yeah. And then he's got the other ones down here. Okay, so he needs like to have a decent amount of content. It's no good, like I say, just putting crap up because you're not going to get anywhere. And that's what we found is that people will just like sort of, you know, chuck 50 words on a site and expect it to run. Well, it ain't gonna happen. Google is your best friend. Google will tell you what's gonna run because everything that's on page one, you know, has got the what you need. So what I would do is look down these, and I wouldn't take all of them, I would just look for bits like sort of you know. He's on about security upgrades. Well, I'm possibly not going for security upgrades. Or oh, lock fitting might, you know, home security might be something for a different site. You know, deterrent burglars. Now, I might be doing something on small businesses. Or oh, emergency locksmith is what we're doing. So let's have a look. So, emergency locksmith, just cut that one for now. I'm just chucking it into my spin rewriter. If you haven't got spin rewriter, there is other spinners on the market, but I've used spin rewriter for God knows how long. 
Um, and basically, to me, it's the best thing since sliced bread for doing this type of job. It does exactly as it says on the tin, and it works all the time. So I just chuck that in. Uh, what else have we got locked out? Yeah, we'll have that. Chuck that in. Now that locks this lead with the old text of the video, so I don't have these skinny, so I don't need that. And then I'm just going to chuck one more in. Um, So you've got lockouts twice really, so you've got lockouts there, and then you've got locked out there. So you're using two keywords, very clever. Yeah, uh, see so we do with Right, so basically, you know, I've got, and like I say, I would take it from all of the sites, you know, bit of here, bit of there, you know. Next thing I do is I go through, I read it, right, leads, I need to change that to location. Okay, so I want to change that to location. Obviously, if I'm doing it on the MWB, then I want to change it to in case all the pattern on one, like that case. Yeah, so it depends on what you're doing, you know, which of the software you've got, but you know, that's what you want. Either one of them two. Say I was doing this for so I would just now go through, do a search, read, wherever leads is, I'm going to change it. Ah, there's a lot of leads. Right, that should be all the leads, right? Yeah. Okay, so that was the first one. So just, just have a quick read through. Now let's have a look. Right, so. We've got no mention of company name or, I mean, you can change it when you get through, but I like changing things straight away. We've got no na mention of company name in there, so, okay. Now, if you are doing it for, like I say, you know, PBNs or stuff like that, then you might be able to get away with one bit rewrite, right? but I don't, for, especially from the MPP sites, I don't. I want to do it properly, so I'll do start rewriting. Okay, and the first thing I do is go right at the bottom, hit that, and say okay. Because sometimes I want to change things around, I want to put new other stuff in. Yeah. So now all I do is I go up here, click on that, and it comes up and tells us. All right, but there's obviously some things what I don't want to put in because it will sound absolutely rubbish when you know it's like urgent locksmith. Who's ever going to say for energy locksmith? And even if they've read it, you think, oh, that sounds a bit nah. Yeah? So emergency's there. Um, I mean, that's nothing else in there. But what I would do, like I said, I've just made that so I can edit it, because I would also change that to myself. So you just put the brace there, put the pipe, 
24 hour. Then you can put another pipe and put 24 hour. And then complete it with the second grade. Uh, so you've got 24 hour, 24 hour locksmith. Uh, obviously, you don't want to change locksmith because that is your keyword. Or what you could do is change it to locksmith. So now we will alternate on different pages. It will have one will have 24 hour locksmith, the other one will have emergency locksmiths. So then you've got here at so you could have a look at, does here change it or anything? No, right here, below, this is here, the corner is that. Is. Not really, so leave that one at locksmith location. We know. So let's have a look at what we know. If those things underlined, then we understand, we realize, now we need to change that because it's spelt Americanized. Let's get it Englishized. So we know, we understand, we realize how much to change that. Yeah, but I want just how much. Yeah, that could sound okay. The amount of, well, no, I don't want that. How much money of, no. What amount of, no. So that'll do. Of a pain. Of a soreness, of a suffering. Problem, yeah, that could sound alright. So, you know, annoyance, yeah, that could sound alright. It can be, so you go down, it could be, yeah, it may be. The two spans are maybe there. So that's all you do, you just go down and do all of this, all the way down to the bottom. And what I get normally down the bottom is 99% unique with billions of possible versions. Yeah. Once that's done, you can click save for later. You know, if you get halfway through and you need to go get your key or something like that, you can click save for later. Once it's done, you do finalize article. It will then finalize it and go onto a different screen um, oh my god, do it. I'll just zap it later. So, go through there. Now, what I always do before I change any of the name or anything like that is actually generate a unique version. Because if I've been putting stuff in, sometimes it will, you know, I might miss a brace off or something like that. And it totally messes it up. And then you've got to go through and try and find where you did wrong. Okay? So, that's created a version for us. Obviously, it's you know, not that unique. It's 50% unique just with them few words I put in. And that's it. And then you, you know, use that. That will give you like sort of your, in your archive so you can rename it to your emergency locksmith. Yeah, rename article. And then you can stick it into a category. I'm not going to hit the categories because I'll show you all my categories. So you put it in a category, like locksmith category, and then basically it's saved. And when you want to use it, just go in, pick it up, pick up this bit here, you know, control A, control C, stick it in your text, job done. Or like say, you know, you can maybe put that bit in and put, you know, the locked out into a, a separate section, the lock, you know, However you build your sites, but you can build all your page up like that. Yes, it takes a long time. Yes, it's a pain in the backside. But once it's done, you can use this on numerous sites. You know, and I will create five pages, four to five pages for every site. One will be my home page, which will also go down as the magic page. And the other three or the other four will be the services. So say for this one, I would have a UPVC doors repaired page and it would just have on all about UPVC doors. I would have an auto locksmith page and it would have on there. I'd have a locked out page and it would be on there. You know, I'd have a commercial 
like sort of watching the station at film there. And each one of them would have a minimum of 500 to 1,000 words on, which would all be spun. I'd then put images in, which I would spin. I'd put videos in, which I'd spin. The whole lot. So that basically, my site is going to be a damn sight better than what these guys are. Uh, because all of this here, uh, yeah, okay, you had some old text in there, but mine would have old text. If I've got a video on, you not know, the one with the video. If I have a video on, show the video. Uh, like that, then that video would be relevant for the location. So if that was a lead video, this would say, like, got your blah, blah, blah leads. And if I go to Manchester, it would be blah, blah, blah Manchester. And it would have the schema behind it for that as well. Okay? Put your effort in and your sites will rank and they will stand you in good stead for years to come. Stick up rubbish that might rank, but you'll not get anything off of it. Hope that helps. Speak to you later, guys. Bye.